Hey YouTube, Stack Attack here with a box of pennies. We're gonna be looking for old coins today. Hopefully we'll find some wheat pennies. Or we'll probably find some wheat pennies. Uh, hopefully we'll find an Indian head, that would be great. Um, didn't see anything looking through the, the top of the box. Noticed it's coming apart here, so we'll open it up carefully so things don't spill all over the place. But, uh, let's see what we got on this side. Some coppery looking coins, but uh, I don't know, what's that? 80 something? Okay, oh, sorry. Here. Yeah. So, all right. Well, I don't see any definite wheat pennies here, so we'll start opening, and as soon as we find something, we'll let you know. All right, this is crazy. We're more than halfway through the box, and we just found our first wheat penny. We did get. Uh, well, I'll show you this first. It's got some wear to it. 30s. Tw 28S. Oh, my. Is that a key? I don't know. We'll don't have to look that up. Of... That's cool. We don't, yeah, we don't see a lot of S mint marks system. or like older coins with mint marks. Um, so that's cool. We'll have to look that up and hopefully, hopefully it's like a valuable coin after we've gotten halfway through the box and found uh, just this as our first Wheat penny, we also found, could have been a wheat penny, um, old enough to be a wheat penny, I should say, 1952 uh, Canadian, some junk on it, but awesome find, we're on the board, 1928S, awesome. All right, a little bit different than what we uh, normally find, but we got this uh, 1989 with an Alabama counter stamp on it. I know there are some sets out there of that have all the states on them, but... Uh, we don't find them too often, so cool find. All right, well, not spectacular, but we got another older Canadian. This one's a 1957. And, uh, yeah, so second Canadian that's old enough to be a wheat penny, but we still only have one wheat penny, and we've got five rolls to go, so hopefully the next five rolls are really good. All right, did get a wheat penny. So let's see what we got here. Doesn't Looks pretty nice, so probably not too old. No, 1957D. All right, well, we got a second wheat penny. Hopefully we'll find some more. All right, so that's everything. We ended up with five Canadians. These are the two older ones and only two wheat pennies. So one of our least uh, uh, quantity hunts in a while, but uh, we were just saying this 1928, it's, uh, I don't know, worth at least a dollar or two, so... You know, it's the equivalent of finding you know, a dozen or 20, you know, 1950s or something. So sometimes you find a ton of newer wheat pennies and sometimes you just find one or two old ones. And so this was a quantity, not, no, this was a quality hunt, not a quantity hunt. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for coming along. It's the way it goes sometimes. You win some, you lose some. And uh, we'll see you next time. Good luck in your hunts.